What this one? Yeah. Right. Though, so you have to imagine during the winter months. Yeah, cold. cold. What's that on the left? Yeah. 
Yet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll go back past her. Thank you. 
interesting but again it's just nonsense. The truth behind it is quite boring. Designed by the students of Trinity College with my William Etheridge, built by his friend James Essex, a student of King's. This was in the year of 1749, clearly 25 years after he passed away. How again is the name of Mathematical Bridge? It's just the more weight that goes to the top of it, which pushes itself horizontally across either side of the sandstone block to make itself stronger. Thank you. 
Big eagle it's on the top there, look. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's also been a site of a prank in the 1960s. Students of St. John's still in one of their fastest cars, got a few pump boats just like this, punted it underneath the bridge from there using chains that form the path of the bridge. Of course, you wouldn't be too happy with that. Sure. Pub. You, see, you can see pictures of this on all over Google Images. The majority of pubs, bars, restaurants here in Cambridge have it, I suppose, with frames on the wall. But that is a very Cambridge thing to do, just still with the best car in front of that location. So we've had cars on top of buildings, on the river using four stilts, again underneath the bridge there, and a few other places around the town. There's loads of pictures of these all over Google Images. When we get back to the pontoon, just stay seated for a couple of moments to have some short fight and then we'll get you out. Of course, uh, we don't want anyone calling in at this point. 